Ego 4D, Around the World in 3,000 Hours of Egocentric Video. Activity understanding from videos is one of the major goals in computer vision. The fundamental questions of activity understanding include, what did you do in the past? What are you doing now? And what will you do in the future? These questions have been studied using large video data sets like YouTube 8M and AVA. These data sets usually only capture people using a third person perspective. In this paper, we study these questions by introducing a new data set and benchmarks called Ego 4D, a collection of first person videos that observe surrounding scenes from the actor's point of view. These videos closely capture the way we see and interact. We envision Ego 4D data will bring out a number of applications, for example, robotics and augmented reality. Ego 4D data include more than 3,000 hours of video from 74 worldwide locations in nine different countries. Comparing to existing data sets, Ego 4D is an order of magnitude bigger in participants and hours. These videos are unscripted and in the wild, representing natural interactions of camera wearers in the world. For example, see videos of walking activities taking place in different continents that depict diverse scene context and geometry. Cooking and shopping activities from different countries show location specifics, cuisine, materials, and methods. Further, cultural diversity of social interactions can be seen from Ego 4D data captured from diverse social settings. Ego 4D data are collected by complying with institutional review board guidelines from each institution. And each camera wearer is given a proper instruction about data capture and the right to review and remove as signing a consent form. Person identifiable information, for instance, cell phone, credit card, license plates, and a subset of faces are de-identified. Activity in each video is narrated nearly every four seconds totaling 3.8 million sentences that include 1,700 verbs and 4,300 nouns. This narration describes detailed interactions, for instance, hand-object interactions, which facilitate language grounding. Ego 4D data is multimodal. It includes audio, 3D pose, inertial measurement, stereo videos, synchronized multi-person videos, and gaze measurement. Audio is accompanied by the video, facilitating audio-visual perception. Ego 4D data includes 3D geometry. An egocentric image on the right is localized in the 3D reconstructed space on the left. This will allow understanding egocentric activity in a larger context of scenes. Ego 4D data includes inertial measurements. Here, we show 3D acceleration and orientation that the camera wearer experiences while riding a bicycle. A subset of Ego 4D data provides stereo videos. Ego 4D data includes synchronized multiple videos that capture social interactions. More than four members playing a card game are recorded in multiple perspectives. Ego 4D data include eye tracking measurements. With Ego 4D data, we present a diverse set of benchmark challenges to answer the fundamental questions of activity understanding. What did I do in the past? What am I doing now? What will I do in the future? We study past activity using an episodic memory benchmark challenge. For instance, given a language query, what color was the tent? An algorithm is expected to answer the question by reviewing the video and identify the associated time instances. 
Similarly, a visual query task is to localize the object of interest by reviewing videos. Here we are asked to find a brush. The episodic memory task also includes moment query temporally localizing the activity of interest. For example, when did I fold clothes? We study what am I doing now using hand object interaction, audio visual diarization and social interaction. For hand object interaction, we identify the state change of an object induced by object hand interaction. For instance, a person is about to put the rice in the bowl. The state change of bowl and rice occurs at the moment that the rice contacts with the bowl. We call this moment of state change as point of no return frame. An algorithm is expected to localize the state change temporally and spatially. The audio-visual diarization captures the conversational interaction dynamics from ego perspective. The benchmark focuses on who said what, when, and where are they located. The tasks of interest are localization and tracking of speakers, active speaker detection, diarization and transcription. Social benchmark task focuses on interactions between social members. For example, an algorithm is expected to detect the social member who is talking to the camera wearer, and detect one who is looking at the camera wearer. We study activity understanding of what will I do in the future using future prediction tasks. The locomotion forecasting task is to predict the future locomotion trajectory of the camera wearer in five to 10 future seconds. Hand forecasting is to predict future hand trajectories. The short-term hand object interaction anticipation task is to recognize which object and when and how the hand will contact with the object. For instance, the camera wearer is about to grasp grass on the ground. An algorithm is expected to predict the action, object, and time to contact. The long-term anticipation task answers the question, what sequence of activities will happen in the future? For example, after watching the camera wearer manipulate the dough, the algorithm is expected to predict that the camera wearer will manipulate another piece of dough pack the spices, and pick up the scraper in sequence. We present a new data set called Ego4D, a collection of unprecedentedly large and diverse egocentric videos. With Ego4D data, we answer fundamental questions of activity understanding through a set of benchmark challenges, which will enable a number of applications, including robotics, augmented reality, and human-centric artificial intelligence.